Katie and welcome to my channel or welcome back to my channel if you've been here before today's video is exciting for a few different reasons so the first reason is that it's the first video of the month of June and going along with that it is exciting because it is the first of 30 videos that will be going up during the month of June and that is because I have decided to do a video every day of June I need something to do with my life besides work and sleep so I figured this would be this would be a good idea and also because I just I need to get out of a rut and doing creative things usually helps me do that so that is why sorry about my breakfast just chilling on the table here but like you know we do we do what we have to do the third reason is because this is actually the first video in a new series on my channel that I'm going to call I got three thrifted looks get it you get the reference you get the reference and i'm calling it that for an obvious reason and that every outfit will feature at least one item that is thrifted and i'll try my best in every one of these videos to include at least one outfit that is just completely thrifted like the outfit i'm wearing right now but more on that in a minute i've been wanting to do this video series type thing for a while now on my channel for a couple different reasons I wanted to, first of all, because I am in law school and I'm a couple years out of college and I know the struggle. So I know that, you know, thrifting saves money. But as a kid, I remember um, having hand-me-downs and going to La Segunda and things like that and thinking that it was weird to have to have hand-me-downs and stuff when it seemed like all the other kids had new clothes and I have a lot of new clothes as well, but like when you're a kid, you don't really really realize I don't know you just pick weird things to notice anyway yeah so it was just it was part it's been part of my life for a long time and now I've really come to appreciate thrift stores and another super important thing that I just want to say is consider donating some of your clothes to thrift stores I know that thrifting is a big thing on YouTube currently which is great because it's sustainable and it's it's just good but I've noticed that a lot of videos um, everybody's talking about their Depop and all that stuff, which is totally fine. I'm not like saying that's bad at all. Like, do what you want to do. That's so fine. But I also know what it's like to actually have to shop at a thrift store. Like, have to. Not just like, oh, I want some cool vintage something. But like, no. Like, actually needing to purchase something from thrift stores because you just, that's what you can afford. And I know that there are a lot of people like that in the United States and everywhere. And so... I just want to encourage everyone to donate clothes maybe that you don't wear a ton anymore but that are still nice and like you would still wear that are still on trend and stuff like that. Consider donating those to a local thrift store because you never know who you could be helping because a lot of consignment shops are still kind of out of the price range and also I would encourage you to look into what the different thrift stores in your area promote, like what their values are, where they donate their money, if they donate their money. I will be featuring different ones throughout the city in this video. I'll be featuring consignment stores as well. I'm going to try to find all of the not-for-profit ones that I can find and featuring them in videos when I can. So today's video features Mount Sinai resale shop. I believe there's only one location of this and it is in Lakeview, but 100% of their proceeds go to Sinai Health Systems and, you know, equipment, things like that, which I think is super important. Healthcare is really expensive. And yeah, I was also born at Mount Sinai Hospital. I saw that they used some of the money from the, the resale shop to purchase like six incubators for the neonatal unit. And um, I was in one for like two weeks because, uh, I didn't have lungs that functioned yet bless but yeah I just think that is so cool but anyway without more talking let's just let's just get into this video you know it still hurts a little bit but not that much because if you want somebody else who am I to judge I've been thinking about you all the time but that's all right 
I'm starting to get used to it. I think I'll survive. I met you in the summer. When you left, it was cold. Said we loved one another. So I guess I'll start with what I am wearing right now, which is this denim jacket. This is from Levi's. Let me let me take it off real quick. So this is just a denim jacket from Levi's and it's got like the light wash with like some distressing and some like different colors. But I got this at Crossroads Trading Company, which is kind of like a Plato's Closet deal. And I got this for $24.99, which is a freaking steal. It has like this cropped length, which is perfect for summer. And then I also, with this, I'm wearing this romper thing. It's a bodysuit, I guess. This is from Macy's and it's just so comfortable. The only thing I don't like about this is the straps are black, but like everything else is like white and yellow. So it's kind of jarring, but you know. I went ahead and paired this one with my white Adidas Superstars, I think they are. They're, they're kind of gray now, but you know, they were once white. As well as my Steve Madden bag that I got a while back. I think it's cool. I feel like every time I wear that bag, it just like ups my like outfit into this like level of cool street style type deal that I really like. So that is what I chose to pair that with. And that is outfit number one. next piece that I have is actually a two-piece set. I have the top here and it's super cute. It's just like a nice blue cotton material with just like the pretty like little floral detail stretchy in the back and it has this tie. It's a nice like bandeau top that actually goes down far enough that paired with the pants that come with it. Well, didn't come with it. I had to buy them separately. They're the same kind of material super light super flowy it was really hot yesterday and i wore these it's like a nice a nice summer staple outfit to have this is from the brand american rag it's like in the junior section of macy's and it was on sale i've really been wanting some bodysuits and two-piece sets so that is why i purchased these at macy's just because i couldn't find ones in my size at the thrift store so i paired this with these Steve Madden shoes. I got these at the Mount Sinai resale shop in Lakeview, Chicago also. Um, and these were literally, I think $5. They have like the cool, really summery BG detail. They're in pretty good shape. And I was like, yes, getting these, getting them. Now tying into the beachy theme, yesterday was just like a full beachy day. I also got this at the Mount Sinai resale shop. So this is just a little tote bag. It's another one of those like kind of twine, like it's like one of those bucket bags. It's like big this year, it was big last year too. And it's kind of like a nice tote size. So I really like it because you can just fit everything you need in it. Yesterday I had like my camera, basically like just like a lot of stuff, a lot of stuff in this bag. I'm just staring at my walls and talking to myself now and then I'll try to laugh, but I'll cry a bit as well. I was never any good at being away from you. All right, and then last, I just have what I am wearing. So it's just this tank top, which has like a super low back, super cute, love. I got this at Crossroads Trading Company. So this one was like $15, but I think it's really cute, so it's it's fine. Because Chicago cannot decide. So I'm wearing the same Levi's jacket that I wore in the first outfit that I got from Crossroads as well. And actually these jeans are from Crossroads also. And they're just this acid wash, like legging type of jeans. I don't even think they have real pockets, yeah. They're pretty much jeggings, but they're so cute. Obsessed. And I think they were like $11, which is pretty cheap. 
but yeah that's that's about it that's it for these outfits and that's really it for these outfits so i hope that you guys enjoyed this first installment of i got three thrifted looks and i will hopefully see you in my next one bye guys all right thank you guys so much for watching i hope that you enjoyed this video if you did please like down below comment subscribe that would be amazing i will leave the information for both thrift stores that i mentioned down below especially check out the mount sinai resale shop if you live in the area because you can donate things there if you want to you can also sell to crossroads which is nice because that does help out you know you can sell some of your old stuff before you get some new stuff but definitely consider donating that's really that's really about it so i guess i will see you guys in tomorrow's video bye guys without you i'm so alone i'm a true man